The James Webb Telescope's release photographs have garnered worldwide attention. These stunning images shed light on the cosmos in ways that have never been seen before, illuminating hidden structures and patterns in a way that has never before been possible. Another type of excitement has resulted from this, with onlookers now wondering if this amazing equipment could be the key to establishing contact with alien life. We're going to investigate the big question of the day. Will the James Webb Space Telescope find alien life? The December 2021 launch of the James Webb marks a new era of space exploration. Since the spacecraft was able to escape Earth's atmosphere with such efficiency that the mission's expected lifetime was virtually doubled within the first few hours, we have already passed some magnificent milestones as we have watched with increased interest as the telescope has moved itself into position over a million kilometers from Earth. Some have likened the first moments of the telescope's full operation to the sight of a big bird spreading its wings for the first time. The telescope's primary mirror is larger than a tennis court. At first glance, the web seemed to be a technologically advanced cylindrical marble. However, now that it is completely functional, it soars through space far away as a remarkable work of engineering and creativity. The mission's execution has been nearly flawless thus far. In July of 2022, NASA revealed the first five photographs during a global ceremony hosted by Vice President Joe Biden. And at last, the world could see for itself what all the commotion was about. The first image's stunning clarity made visible thousands of whole galaxies that had previously been invisible to us, all of which were contained into an area of sky no larger than a pinprick from Earth. According to NASA, the size of the object we observed was equivalent to the area covered by a single grain of sand held at arm's length from the surface of the Earth. This single image, better than any other, has shown the real scale of the universe. Four further photos were revealed the next day. The first shows a nebula exploding with gas and dust. The second shows a composite of five galaxies interacting. The third shows star birth along the nebula's edge. And the fourth shows the collapse of a distant gas giant's atmosphere. And that last one may be the most crucial of them. When it comes to the hunt for extraterrestrial life, Webb's first atmosphere composition public release focuses on the gas giant exoplanet, WASP 96 bits, with a distance of over 1,100 light years. This alien world was first spotted in 2013. It takes slightly more than three days to complete one orbit around its yellow dwarf star, and it is just about half as massive as Jupiter. The most important thing is that water is present. The James Webb Telescope has proven this beyond a reasonable doubt. Webb has an incredibly precise field of view, allowing it to pick up on minute variations in an object's brightness. This means, among other things, that it can identify the molecules that make up a planet's atmosphere when trained on that planet. Plus, there's water, H2O, on WASP 96 bits. Water is, of course, one of the most promising evidence of possible life any place in the universe and of the possibility of human habitation should we one day need to look elsewhere in the universe for a home away from Earth. It's possible at this point that WASP 96 bits won't provide either extraterrestrial life or a future home for humans. Nonetheless, Webb's unmatched research into it so far provides a glimpse into an incredibly promising future. Over the past few years, the SETI, Search for Alien Intelligence, has received more and more attention and has become more and more influential. However, it may be argued that we've never had anything quite like this to make SETI conceivable before. Now that we have Webb, we can look at planets and moons and observe them for what they really are, rather than treating them as a vague, maybe destination for some hypothetical extraterrestrial power. We now have a better chance than ever before of discovering biosignatures of life on other worlds. It's also worth noting that this isn't a tangential use of the James Webb data. Its official mission aims include learning more about the early cosmos and how galaxies, stars, and planets formed, as well as searching for habitable worlds and the possible origins of life. Thanks to decades of exoplanet hunting and missions like WASP and Kepler, our catalog of known extrasolar planets keeps growing. In addition, we now have a more accurate estimate of the total number of planets in the universe. And it's in the high billions, if not the trillions. But until now, we haven't had many opportunities to really get to know any of them. But thanks to Webb's foresight, 
That's about to drastically and rapidly alter. Also, Webb will be joined in its cosmic exploration by a number of other next-generation telescope missions, such as the Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope, which are all set to launch in the near future. If aliens are so probable, then where are they? This is the famous question posed by the Fermi Paradox. And maybe, just maybe, we have the technology to provide an answer now more than ever. Some have speculated that if extraterrestrial life does exist, Webb will discover it. And probably through in-depth atmospheric research, like the one we've had a sneak peek at for WASP 96 bits, any extraterrestrial civilization we discover won't necessarily know that we know about them, which is obviously a plus. Although Webb's sunshield is as large as a tennis court, it is still a relatively little object in comparison to the vastness of the universe. So unless the aliens we could find already know were here, it's not as if we'll be any more noticeable than normal. This is a SETI mission with nearly negligible cosmological footprint. This is far field SETI. Yet, we're still doing our search in high definition. But it doesn't mean there won't be hiccups down the road. To date, the Webb mission has gone off almost flawlessly, as we said at the beginning of this movie. After a lengthy wait, the launch finally occurred, and everything went off without a hitch. The telescope's pinpoint launch ensured that it would reach its destination and fully unfurl without incident, extending its useful life by at least twice its original estimate. On the other hand, the first issue surfaced in late July of 2022 when it was reported that a meteoroid collision had irreparably destroyed one of the panels that make up Webb's mirror. Now, this isn't always vital to the operation. One modest hit to one of Webb's 18 panels is not expected to have a major influence on the spacecraft as a whole, but it does show how dangerous space is once you leave Earth's protective orbit. And if a meteoroid can cause damage in the first few months, how likely is it that the same thing will keep happening over and over again until Webb is so battered and bruised that it can no longer function. Web controllers will now be under pressure to provide a response to this query. Considering the mission's rumored $10 billion price tag thus far, a lot is riding on its continued success. Assuming Web maintains its current level of operation, more photographs similar to those already published would be very appreciated. And from SETI point of view, we absolutely require additional worlds to be viewed in as clear and clinical detail as WASP 96 bits presently is. Using the first picture as a starting point, we can now make an accurate water map of the cosmos, intent on going where the sea leads us. How do you rate Webb's infancy? What do you think it will find in the days, months, and years to come? How likely is it that we will make contact with aliens in the near future? If this is the case, we may soon make the greatest discovery in human history and the science fiction dreams of the 20th century may become the reality of the 21st. Do we have no companions in the cosmos? In fact, it's one of the most fundamental questions we have, but a brave telescope a million kilometers distant may have the answer we've been waiting for. That's why Webb was able to find evidence of extraterrestrial life. Thank you for watching this video until the end. Like and subscribe to our channel to make sure you don't miss any incredible news about the James Webb Space Telescope. We have another yet incredible video ready for you. Click on the video on your screen and let us take you on to another adventurous space story. See you there.